Okay guys, back again with another video to help you out. Uh, earlier in my YouTube career, I guess you could call it, I did a video on how to remove the steering wheel airbag out of a 2016 Volkswagen Golf uh, GTI. Uh, this time, this is a 2011 Volkswagen Golf GTI. Uh, a little different, uh, but a little bit the same. So uh, if, if it's a... Uh, if you went and looked at that video, it's probably not the same style as what you're working with. Um, but uh, we'll go ahead and show you how to take the airbag out of this one. Uh, it was a pain uh, for me, and I do this stuff all the time, so I can't imagine uh, somebody doing it at home. Uh, perhaps you want to change the steering wheel or, or any number of different things. Anyway, um, anytime you start messing with airbags, you got to make sure you take the battery um, loose and take the terminals off and let it sit for a little bit. You don't want an airbag go off in your face. Anyway, after you do that, uh, you'll pull the clamshell off the back side of your steering column. It's just clipped on there. Uh, you can even pull it all the way out if you want. It's just held in to these clips here. And then you'll have two holes on the back side of the steering column, like on the 2016 video. Um, but I've already sacrificed this steering wheel to show you what's going on back here and uh, the way the steering wheel airbag works is it's got these two wire clips right here right here in front and all they do is hook over all they do is hook over the uh, edges of the steering wheel I have a pin here right down here there's one spot where it hooks over and then over here it hooks over this spot so you'll be at 10 and 2 or 10 and 2 you'll be at you know sideways on the steering column this way and then this way to remove it and you'll just see this wire clip over top of the edge of this hook right here so you'll get in between the edge of the clip and that hook and pry, pull your screwdriver this way, push it up, twisting upward from front to back. And that will push this clip inward. It'll push this clip here inward and it'll take you a little bit of force to get this thing far enough in that's where i was having issues that's why i had to sacrifice the side of this steering wheel so i could get in and see what i was doing um, but pushing this in as far as you can get it to go will eventually release it with the spring pressure to get the steering wheel airbag to pop out and you may need to put a screwdriver or something in on this side when you go to do the other side to keep it from popping back in on the opposite side. I've had that happen before and it's a pain and it's frustrating and makes me want to throw screwdrivers. Anyway, that's about all there is to getting the airbag out of the steering wheel. And then you've got your wire clips here to detach to remove your airbag and then whatever other business you got going on in here. Anyway, that's all there is to getting it out. Seems like it's a lot easier than that. Uh, it'll frustrate you for a little while until you can get these clips pushed in far enough to release it. But it can be done. So anyway, thanks for watching. Hope you get it done. Like and subscribe.